hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in ASP.NET how to prevent duplicate records and display label message when we redirect the same web page after inserting the records and here we got the final output after we adding the session functionality now let's add a new student Peter P, p at gmail.com let's insert this Peter record insert see now we got the message the last of newly inserted student ID is 11 let's check in the table also browse and here we got the Peter record the student ID is 11 I'm reloading the browser see the student ID is remain 11 only and I click browse see there is no duplicate records of the Peter if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates in this part 2 I will show you when a user insert the new record for example here the username is Lakshmi Kumari the email is lk at gmail.com and I insert new record see here we got the message the last or newly inserted student ID is 7 let's check in the database table I'm browsing the table see here we got the student Lakshmi the ID is a 7 yes, but one major problem is when I reload or refresh this page continue see if you notice the student ID is 8 but the student details are the same one Lakshmi Kumari and elk at gmail.com let's browse the table see here we got the Lakshmi record is duplicated but the student ID is 8 so to prevent this duplicate inserting when reload or refresh the browser switch to the code behind and stop debugging in the button click event response dot redirect the method request dot url dot to string method comma false there are so many methods we can prevent duplicate values but this is a very simplest way now let's check the output I'm reloading the browser link and here we got the new output after adding the response dot redirect method in the button click event let's enter the new student details Warren page v at yahoo.com when I click insert new record I notice once the record is insert I am not getting the message in the label the last inserted row id but the record is inserted successfully in this table in this student table browse see here the student Varun the student id is 10 I am reloading the browser again again I'm browsing the table see here we're not adding the duplicate records in this student table but we are not getting the last student ID value in the label control so to fix this problem let's get back to the coding part in the page load if null not equals to I'm adding session here last ID label one dot visible is equals to true now in the label dot text I'm adding the session value copy this here 
after two string method come to the bottom instead of label text I am adding the session value this one session lost ID that's it let's check the final results Google Chrome and here we got the final output after we adding the session functionality now let's add a new student Peter P P at gmail.com let's insert this Peter record insert see now we got the message the last of newly inserted student ID is 11 let's check in the table also browse and here we got the Peter record the student ID is 11 I'm reloading the browser see the student ID is remain 11 only and I click browse see there is no duplicate records of the Peter that's it